Hey guys, it's Raz Daz Rax, and today I'm going to be doing a tutorial on how you guys can teach your Rax to roll over. So, Donut here has already been starting to learn roll over, and so the method that I've been using is the same method that I've been using to, that or that I have used to teach my dog roll over, and it works well for Rax as well. So, at, for treats, I'm going to be using a solid treat, and I'm going to be using these blueberry Gerber puffs and just breaking them up into halves. And these work really well for this trick and other tricks, and I find that my rats really do enjoy them. Um, I have blueberry and sweet potato, which they really, really do love. So, before I start training I, or training a new trick, I like to do a warm up. So, Donut is just going to do a few simple tricks um, spin. Maybe we'll do some weaving just to get her warmed up. Um, although she does already know the concept of this trick, we're going to do just a little warm up to get her ready and started. So, we're going to get her to do a few spins <laughs> after she's finished treating the treat. And yes. Good girl. Okay. Um, with the weaving, I normally will use um, a liquid treat because I find that she focuses better with liquid treats when she's doing weaving. Come on, no, oh my goodness, she's like, she's like, normally you use a liquid treat, why are you using this? Come on. Come on. Good girl. <laughs> you think, girly? You all warmed up? You all warmed up? Oh yeah. Oh no! Don't go down there! Okay, so, um, I'm going to be using a solid treat, as I believe I said before, and I'm just going to be breaking up the Gerber puffs into smaller pieces, because the bigger the piece, the longer it takes for them to eat it. So, to start, you're going to make sure that your rat already knows the ring, and you're going to basically use your treat and push it down to their sides, or like right on this part of their neck. And then it's going to basically force them to have to roll over. And <laughs> she's, she's being so silly right now. Oh my goodness, why are you always climbing me? Why are you always climbing my back? It's so silly. You ready? So yeah, you push it back to their to right around to their, the side of their neck, right underneath their ear. And you want to make sure that your rat is very food driven, that they're going to be willing to follow the food, um, because this is going to make teaching all tricks so much easier. So as you can see, Donut is going under the blanket. Um, I do have a carpet down, but I just use a blanket just to create a better surface for her to do her tricks on, but she seems to enjoy going underneath them more than actually doing the trick on top. So yeah, you just lure them, make sure, and then basically, I'm actually going to, this one is eating this one. So what you're going to do is you're going to basically lead their treat and then lead it up to this side of their, of their, like right underneath their ear. So as you can see, Donut basically followed that, even while I was holding her. Um, but yeah, so you basically just, you push it up to underneath their ear, and this is going to force them to roll over. So I did just trick Donut there, and I didn't even have a treat. She's like, what the heck? But yeah, so once your rat knows that, you're going to start to speed up the process. For now, she's just getting the whole rollover point, or what she needs to do for rollover, and teach them basically the beginner tricks, as I call them, which are spin and paw. And then you get into more complex ones, which I believe I have talked about in my earlier videos, such as my spin and paw video, and those are basically the two tricks that you want to teach your rats before you get into tricks like this. Um, so yeah, steps are teach your rat luring, then teach them the beginner tricks, and then you move on to luring them. You lure their treat here, forces them to spin, and then you reward. So let's just get Donut to do a few more rollovers before we end the video. Come. Last one. Oh no, don't run away. Come. Come here. Oh my goodness, and she's climbing my back once again. Come, go ahead. Last one. 
Okay guys, so that's the end of the video. I hope this video was useful in you guys training your rats to roll over, and I hope you enjoyed the video. As you can see, Donut is enjoying this Gerber puff here. Thank you guys for watching!